Hey YouTube, today we have a surprise unboxing, uh, all the way from like Sujen or Szechuan or something, China, by way of Cupertino. I cut it beforehand, so I don't have one of those super duper package opening knives that everybody has, and ta-da, it's a box. And if you look, the packaging is beautiful, green, cardboard, no foam packaging, easy on the environment, and out of the shot. <coughs> Peeling off the little paper. You know, they could save a lot of paper by not using this paper on the outside. We all know what's in here. But I guess they want to heighten the surprise in case we forgot what we ordered. See, it's that shiny waxy paper. And there it is. The new shuffle. About as big as my thumb and a half. Four gigabyte, only one it comes in, in silver. Peel off the one piece of plastic with the arrow on the top. Very nice. Headphones glued to the back. Here's your little charger. I kind of like this better than the dock. I wonder if it'll hold up a little longer than the other dock. Start here. instructions and teeny weeny apple stickers pull tab on the back Other pull tab. And as you can see, there are the controls for the shuffle. I don't know how well you can see this, but there's the volume up, volume down. I really wonder how durable this will be. I don't know if you can see it, but. There's the play pause button. It feels kind of strong, like it might last a while. Time will tell with that. Here are the Apple earbuds. Maybe these are a little more comfortable. I don't know. Okay, so there's your headphone. Now to take the shuffle off. A lot of tape on these. Piece of plastic. Shiny clip on the silver ones. Had it engraved. So that's what that looks like. There's the silver shuffle. Button on the front off, play straight through, shuffle your songs, and you can see tiny, tiny, tiny light. You 
can't tell if it's on or not. I did see the red, so I'm assuming it needs charged. I can't really see if it's on because it's so small. One of the things recommended, if you're over 40, you might want to wear your reading glasses to even find the shuffle. <laughs> um, as you can see, basically there's absolutely no tolerance between the headphone jack and the end of the shuffle. So I don't even, I don't think they can make it any smaller until they get a different headphone jack. I mean, in terms of width. The clip feels really nice. Strong clip. Looks like um, it'll hold up a while. You've got some writing underneath the clip, which of course we can't read. But uh, I'm assuming with how shiny this clip is, that the clip will probably scratch up. So maybe Best Skins Ever or Zag will come out with a little piece of film to protect the clip and then some